Metrolink bosses are targeting school pupils in their battle against fair dodging by warning them their futures are at risk. Following a second batch of youth prosecutions this month, 16 and 17 year olds have paid almost £3,000 in fines and costs. We spoke to some tram users to get their opinion on the subject. I think it's unfair because we already have really costly journeys and on top of that they don't seem to be really lenient with us. Like it's kind of just a straight, harsh, kind of callous attitude to us, straight away kind of, no, you're not you're not gonna get a warning. It's just a straight kind of fine hundred pounds and it's like we're only like 15, 16 year olds, you know what I mean? Ticket prices are already expensive for us anyway. Even with an IGO pass, we already have to pay so much. <laughs> If they don't have the ticket, then obviously they should be charged because you can't just jump it and expect to get away with it. Obviously, you wouldn't expect a five-year-old to pay, but if you're over the age of, if you're 16 or over, then you should be expected to pay. That everybody should be treated the same, yeah. but that kids' tickets should be a different price and that the penalties should be less than what we'd have to pay if we didn't have a ticket. Anna Ramsey reporting for Keys TV News.